Okay, well, in the interest of time, and we have closing comments, we have one last question, then we're gonna get into closing comments for each candidate, because there's another meeting that commences here at uh, 7 p.m. So, here it is, and we'll start this time with Mr. Bain. Should you become mayor, list three groups other than the Rain Cross group, Good Morning Riverside, or the Chamber of Commerce that you would seek out for feedback on issues concerning decisions and actions you and the council implement that affect our quality of life. Please list the groups other than those three. The three groups that I have connected with and will continue to connect with is the Latino Network, the group, uh, and I've been, become a member of both the, the Black um, Chamber of Commerce and the uh, Hispanic Chamber of Commerce recently. And we've been to several meetings of theirs. So as a teacher, it's hard for me to get to some of the morning meetings. And so I go to the group um, in the summertime. I wasn't able to make it this summer, but I have met with the leaders of the group in a kitchen cabinet type uh, setting. And I'll continue to do that. Uh, and I meet with religious institutions. I go to the Today's Urban Renewal Network, which is a group of, of uh, religious institutions, faith-based uh, organizations that are looking to solve problems such as homeless and such as foster youth that are aging out and have nowhere to go. So uh, faith-based, obviously, ethnicity and, and groups that are underrepresented um, in our city is where I, I would go and continue. Uh, again, uh, I haven't been able to do that. I see some of the, the members in the group there, Latino Network, because I teach at 6.55 in the morning. So I'm at school at 6 and I get out of there about 10 o'clock. Uh, I have been in the past when I did take a, a leave of absence. I went more regularly to those institutions, um, but I do meet with individuals from those groups, and I will continue uh, to do that. Uh, and if elected mayor, I, I will be able to have more time on my hands uh, to meet with those groups. Yeah, uh, <clears throat> a couple things. Meeting the group, what I mentioned earlier, uh, when you talk about an inclusive uh, community is you try to participate with everybody that you can. So I wouldn't say just reach out to one group and stick with them for a while. I try to bring other uh, groups into the into the fold. Uh, you know, I recently uh, uh, had a visit of the, uh, the Sikh temple and uh, you know, most of them are business people and you learn something from them uh, from a cultural exchange and a cultural difference uh, when you go out and, and reach out for that. Uh, you know, I've, I've been involved with the Knights of Columbus before, uh, the uh, Hispanic Chamber of Commerce, I'd, I'd reach out. Uh, but I'd reach out to a, a lot of different uh, groups in the community and try to make sure that they're, that they're all inclusive in, 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 the, uh, in the process. Because uh, some of these groups appear to, to dominate a lot, they're good groups, uh, but a lot of them you don't have access to. A lot of them, their meetings aren't open. That's one thing I liked about the Friday morning group is that anybody can go there, they invited everybody, and everybody got to participate. And that isn't the case with some of the, some of the groups out there. Uh, so I think uh, it needs to be reciprocal. If they want us to uh, participate with them, they need to want to participate uh, with us as well. So. 30 seconds. Um, I was on Monday night, I went to the, the Homeless Inland Ministries group who invited me out because they have a different style of serving the homeless than um, others do. And so they wanted to make sure and, and that I understood their perspective. And so now they are going to be coming to um, the five-year plan meeting that we're having uh, next week, the workshop. And I invite you all to come if, if homelessness is an issue that you want to, to weigh in on and contribute to. Tuesday, um, uh, this next Tuesday, Council Day, we should be ha scheduling a workshop uh, during the day. And so I'll continue to, okay, three more seconds? Oh, I'm sorry. I got <laughs> oh, God. So, you know, another avenue that I've taken to, to get some perspective on, on issues. What, can I add that on there just for clarification? On that, what was the three groups that you said that you didn't want to mention? The um, Monday morning, no, excuse me. Chamber. Ray Cross Group. Good morning, Riverside. Yeah, good morning, Riverside. Can I, can I clear? Well, I thought you said the group was one of those that, other than the group, yeah, the Rain Cross and the Chamber, because you said group three times. Yeah.